And despite the stormy start, if tourism officials are expecting a record-breaking holiday weekend, hopeful that they'll get more people than last year, and the amount of spending will also skyrocket. As Heather Hammer reports, from the lakes to the beaches, vacationing going strong. Thunderstorms last night and some rain today did make for a slow start to the holiday weekend. But here on Meredith Bay, it's not getting people down. Those we spoke with say that visiting here on July 4th is a tradition, and they're not willing to break it. And we come up uh, every year for the 4th of July. We uh, usually go to the parade in Wolfboro. We stay in Ossipi at Whitson Campground every year. And then we come here for the decking race. And even with the rain and overcast skies, this year was no different. It's just not going to keep us keep us from coming. So we did put her in the camper last night instead of the tent. Right, <laughs> exactly. It's a slight change, no big deal. Right, right. And it looks like a lot more people feel the same. The New Hampshire Division of Travel and Tourism expects this holiday weekend to be record-setting, according to a report by the Institute for New Hampshire Studies. From July 3rd to the 7th, about 880,000 visitors may come from out of state and are expected to spend about $131 million. The Stanfords made it a family affair. My mother's here with the 10 kids and the many grandchildren, and we do this event every year at the same hotel. Those who own local cottages say they are booked solid. Paul Casaza owns Cozy Cove Cottages and says tradition drives the tourism. Year after year, he has repeat customers. I had no problem with this week or next. From the lakes region to the seacoast. Even if it was going to rain, I was still going to come out to the beach because there's no better place than the beach. And for some, the less than perfect weather was a perk. That made us come here because we knew it wasn't going to be a huge crowd. But the lack of crowds may be short-lived. With beautiful weather expected for Saturday and Sunday, there should be no shortage of people out and about. Most of the people in the state this holiday weekend are from other parts of New England or even Canada. They say it makes for easy travel and more time right here in New Hampshire. Reporting on Meredith Bay, Heather Hamill, WMUR News 9.